السلام علیکم اسٹوڈنٹس دس از یور کمپیوٹر ٹیچر عائشہ انور آئی ہوپ آل آف یو آر فائن اینڈ فالوئنگ دی لیکچرس دیٹ آر بینگ شیئر وتھ یو وی آر اسٹڈنگ چیپٹر نمبر ٹو وچ از اباؤٹ آپریٹنگ سسٹم اپ ٹل ناؤ وی ہیو کورڈ دی بیسک انٹروڈکشن آف آپریٹنگ سسٹم اینڈ دی فنکشنز آف آپریٹنگ سسٹم دی ٹاپک دیٹ وی آر گوئنگ ٹو ڈسکس از the interfaces of operating system here we need to understand the concept of an interface what is an interface interface is basically a something through which we can interact with the operating system for example uh, like if you are using a mobile you can see a particular screen so that screen is basically known as the interface you can see a uh, different type of icons on the interface of your mobile screen and uh, we also see some um, icons and files and a simple text bar for searching like that so it is an uh, interface that is provided by the mobile so operating system uh, has a uh, different interfaces which means that we can uh, how we can interact with the computer so there are the three types of interfaces of operating system here they are mentioned command line interface cli menu driven interface and the most commonly used is graphical user interface short as gui so we can say the interface is the way of interaction with the computer simply we can say it is this uh, the screen which we see on the computer and using that screen uh, how we interact with the computer is known as the interface so let's go through them one by one first one is cli or command line interface in command line interface commands are given to the computer with keyboard as its name tell command line interface so it means we have to enter and we have to type the commands with the help of keyboard it is based on textual input textual input means um, we have to enter the commands in the form of text like uh, the short words like open close delete remove like this the user types in a command and presses the enter key to execute it whenever we have typed a command and now we want to execute that command we have to press the enter key so that that command is executed two commonly used operating system that has cli interface are dos and unix dos and unix are two operating systems which have interface command line interface CLI is basically difficult to use because we have to remember and memorize the command to perform any task so if i don't know the syntax of uh, of a command or if i don't know the command how am i going to operate the computer it will be very difficult for me to operate the computer without knowing the commands and without even knowing their syntax so command line interface are difficult to use as we have discussed that cli interface is used in dos and unix operating system first of all we are going to discuss dos dos basically stands for disk operating system it was the most popular command line interface operating system dos displays the prompt like this to enter the command we must know the syntax of the command dos commands are difficult to remember if they are difficult to remember then definitely they are difficult to use some dos commands are still supported by the new windows operating system and dos is basically the single user and single task operating system which means that only a single user can operate uh, the computer at one time and he can perform only one task or single task at a time 
it is exact opposite to the windows operating system that we are using these days it is uh, the interface that dos provides us it has the black screen with the white text and you can see that a command that is dir dir command is run and uh, it has uh, given us some results like seven files dot text it, it means that uh, dir command is basically used to list down all the files and folders that are present in the computer and it shows result like this two files and uh, two folders uh, it is very much difficult to uh, use dos to enter commands and to uh, interpret the results that are being received in the result of the execution of a particular commands the second operating system which uses command line interfaces unix it is opposite to the dos as dos was the single user operating system but unix is a multi user command line interface which was introduced in 1969 it allows multiple users to run different programs at the same time again it is opposite to the dos because dos allows only single user to run a single task at a same time but unix allows multiple users to run different programs at the same time unix was developed to learn on uh, to use on large computer systems like mainframes it uses command line interface but later on graphical user interface was also introduced for the unix basically uh, initially when it was released it has cli but with the evolution of a time uh, its new version was introduced which has gui means graphical user interface so here it is the interface that is provided by the unix with the black background and some green text written over here uh, it is uh, you can say that it has the similarity between uh, the dos and the unix that both of them were the textual input the second type of interface is menu driven interface first one was the cli cli was used in dos and unix The second is menu driven interface. In menu driven interface there are some menus that appear on the screen and user makes a choice and the next menu appears and the user makes a choice from the menus and so on. As its name shows menu driven so it means it provides us the different menu I am going to select one option from that menu after selecting the option another menu appears I have to make the selection from that menu again and according to the my selection the new menu appears until my task is done menu driven interfaces are easy to use as compared to CLI because in CLI we have to memorize the commands but in menu driven interface there is no need to memorize the commands because it the commands are already written in the form of menu the user reads the options and makes the choice from th those menus that are given menu contain the commands to use the operating system in cli we have to memorize the commands but in a menu driven the commands are given as the menus so menu driven interface is also also used in some applications and other devices such as mobile phones and ipod it is just like uh, the different menus that are given in your uh, mobile phones uh, we select the option then another option uh, the list uh, of uh, some commands and options is available and we simply select those commands uh, from the menus and uh, we perform our task in this way which is easiest way as compared to cli so menu driven interface is used on two operating systems that is novel netware and prodos so first of all novel netware novel netware was menu driven operating system that was introduced and used in past its first version was released in 1993 
and here uh, you can see its interface with blue screen and uh, you can observe that this uh, type of interface is better than the interfaces that we have discussed in uh, DOS and Unix. The next one is ProDOS. ProDOS was another manual driven operating system that was used on some Apple's computer basically. Apple computer uh, is the company which creates uh, its own devices. We all know that iPhones uh, are uh, developed by Apple company. So Apple company also uh, make different type of devices like iPads, iPods and uh, computers, desktop computer systems also. So ProDOS was used on Apple computers and you can see its interface in this diagram which has black and white interface and uh, it also gives the command in the form of the menus.